Good evening and welcome to Phil Waybright Gymnasium <clears throat> down here in beautiful Argus, Indiana. We got Saturday night basketball action with the Argus Dragons hosting the Gymtown Jimmies. Catching the end of the JV matchup where it is two and a half minutes almost uh, left in the game. Dragons trail 45-48. It's been a back and forth game. And the uh, Gymtown is up at the moment. Well, welcome everyone into the broadcast. All right, it is homecoming night tonight, so we got the homecoming court coming in between games. Very exciting. Yep, good Being stuff Being brought here. to you by Argus TV on our TVC TV4. There you go. <laughs> so uh, last year, the Dragons come out on top. Argus beat Jimtown 49-46 in a double overtime. Ian Kendig dunked it. Yeah, yeah baseline dunk. It was all over the uh, internet, as they say. This year, Dragons are 2-2, two and two, and Jimtown is 2-0. and oh. They are ranked 21 in 3A, and Dragons are ranked 13th in 1A. So it's going to be a really good matchup. The JV has been a great matchup so far. So we're going to see what happens as J.J. Morris puts in a two-pointer. Full court pressure from the Dragons. Minute 56 left. Dragons down by one. Jimtown has really been uh, using that three-point line. Oh, boy. Chipping They're, away. They were yep. down. I can't remember what their highest deficit was. We were too busy getting our equipment set up. Uh, yep. But that three-pointer has really brought them back into this ball game. Knife on with the steal there. Dragons have a chance to take the lead. Knife on to Morris. Morris up, misses, rebound, Morris shot, and he's fouled going to the line shooting two. Nifong did a great dish there. So Brady's getting ready to come in. Caden Brady at the substitution bench. Coach giving the last second instructions. Knife, uh, Morris puts it in. Morris tied it up and gives us the lead by one. Wide open, looks, gets it back. Rotates, Jimtown. Gets it again, minute 18 left in the game. Trailing by one. Gillespie drives. No foul. Morris with the rebound. Goes around him. That is pretty, uh, pretty big number for the second half. Ten to fouls to one on the Dragons. Been super close. Morris puts it in. Full timeout for Jimtown. We're going to take a quick commercial break and we'll come back. We'll get a few things around for getting ready for the homecoming. We'll be back right after this. We're back. 58 seconds left in the game. Dragons up by two. Morris has one more shot at the free throw line. And he better make it because Jimtown has been slaying the three-pointers here in the second half. Mm -hmm. 
All right. And we've got homecoming action here, 2019 homecoming, coming up after this game, in between games. We'll take a break, and we'll get a few things sorted out, and then they'll start getting the procession around and leading them out, and we'll be covering that action tonight in between games. Exciting stuff. Morris, freshman, and he puts it in. He needed that because Jimtown can slay the threes and could have went ahead, but now they have to work at it to tie it. 54 seconds left. Oh, and he throws it away. I'm unfortunate. Turnover, rare turnover. I haven't seen much out of that from either team. Timeout, full timeout. All right, we're going to take a break. Full timeout for the Dragons. We'll be back after this. The Winning Edge is your local provider for all your school athletic needs. From providing customizable sportswear to engraving trophies, the Winning Edge strives to help teams find their edge on the playing field. Visit the Winning Edge today. Locally owned and operated, Mike's Trash LLC in Rochester is your local service for all your trash removal needs. Whether you're a big business or a local resident, Mike's Trash LLC will be sure to take care of all your waste removal needs. Contact Mike's Trash LLC today. All right, we're back. Forty-seven seconds. Dragons up. Fifty-one. Forty-eight. Dragons basketball for the inbounds on the side at the far end of the court. Jimtown clawed their way back into the game. And now the Dragons have worked themselves back into the lead. Stoltz should have been a carry. Down low, Stoltz waits till they jump, misses. Kendig and puts it in. Is that on Stoltz? Did he give a warning? Yep. Foul. Gonna have another 30. 30 second timeout by Jimtown. We'll be back right after this. Let RTC TV4 highlight your business or service in our local sports coverage. Through our platform, you have the option to use a 30 second commercial that you already have, or you can have us make a 15 second logo sponsorship for you. With eight local schools in our partnership, we're sure you'll reach your intended audience. Sponsor with RTC TV4 today. And we're back. 18 seconds left. Dragons up by five. Jimtown ball under their own basket. Looking to get a quick two or a quick three. So we'll see what happens. Gets the ball in, looks. They want behind that three-point line. Long three and it's short. Out of bounds, it's gonna be Dragons basketball. Foul, Morris just held it until they hacked him. He could really have held it the whole time. Well. And that's his fifth, number 10. Yep, Morris will be at the line shooting too. Braxton Rice, he had a good game. He was putting in some threes. Morris at the line, went 0 for 2 the first two we watched, and then he's made four straight. And I jinxed him. Way to go, Andy. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> 
Sorry, JJ. We'll forgive you this time. <laughs> Give us a shout out. We'll put your name out there. Throw you back a little bit of love here from Argus TV at RTC TV4. There you and go. Andy and myself. Uh, she got the she got the cue. Whew. She got it. Figured it out. Foul. Shooting two. Kindig. Got 4.5 seconds on the clock, and I don't think the clock went down at all, actually. Did That's it? All right. <laughs> Not much. <laughs> I don't even think they're cheering tonight. <laughs> oh, and he misses. Puts it in. Fifty-four, forty-nine. Two shots at the line for Morse. Scoot this this way because it's touching the leg of the tripod. Morris is here at the line, getting ready to shoot. Up and puts it in. And two for two. Back to a seven point ball game. Shots up and it's no good. Well, that's gonna do it for the JV matchup. Dragons come out on top, 56-49. We're gonna take a commercial break or two. We're gonna get things rounded up for the homecoming, homecoming action and then We'll uh, come out and get ready for the varsity matchup. Yeah. Oh. What'd she say? She wants to know if she's in the All right, we'll be back after this. This is the 32nd time Christmas has been hosted in this house. 32 times decorating the tree. Holiday dinners. Memories all protected by their independent agent and the company that stands behind them. Auto Owners Insurance. Contact Jennings Insurance Agency today or visit one of our offices in Argus and Rochester. Let RTC TV4 highlight your business or service in our local sports coverage. Through our platform, you have the option to use a 30 second commercial that you already have, or you can have us make a 15 second logo sponsorship for you. With eight local schools in our partnership, we're sure you'll reach your intended audience. Sponsor with RTC TV4 today. And we're back. We're getting ready to do the homecoming. Homecoming. Court. And Amy's going to have the pleasure of reading all that. All right. So good evening and welcome to the 2019 Argus Homecoming. Representing the freshman class, we have Ariana Allen, escorted by Maddox Brady. Ariana is the daughter of Michael and Leslie Allen. She's involved in Sunshine Society, BPA, soccer, and student council. When she was a kid, she wanted to be a vet, but now her future plans are to go to college and study dentistry. Escorting Ariana is Maddox Brady. Maddox is the son of Brad and Shandy Brady. Maddox is involved in soccer, when he was a kid, he wanted to be a cowboy, but now his future plans are to graduate high school, go to college, become a DNR officer, and eventually start a family. Ariana Allen and Maddox Brady. <laughs> All right. Also representing the freshman class is Caitlin DeWolf, escorted by Peyton Heckeman. <laughs> 
Caitlin is the daughter of Terry and Michael DeWolf. Caitlin is involved in BPA, Leo's, Sunshine Society, Volleyball, and Student Council. When Caitlin was a kid, she wanted to be a teacher, but now her future plans are to go to college, get married, and have a ton of dogs. <laughs> Escorting Caitlin is Peyton Heckerman. He is the son of Douglas and Stephanie Heckerman. He's involved in band, show choir, tech theater, dairy judging, FFA, 4-H, and BPA. When Peyton was a kid, he wanted to be a bus driver, but he will <laughs> let us know about his future plans when he gets around to it. Caitlin DeWolf and Peyton Heckerman. Peyton, a cameraman and tech leader here for RTC4 for Argus. <laughs> Representing the sophomore class, first we have Hannah Trump escorted by Michael Richard. Hannah is the daughter of Kim and Brian Trump. She's involved in Sunshine Society, soccer, cheerleading, Leo's, FCA, student council, and show choir. When she was a kid, she wanted to be an artist, but now her future plans are to graduate high school and further her education. Escorting Hannah is Michael Richard. He is the son of Jason and Tori Richard. He is involved in student council, basketball, and soccer. When Michael was a kid, he wanted to be Iron Man, but now his future plans are to defeat Thanos. <laughs> Hannah Trump and Michael Richard. And some people will get that reference. <laughs> you bet. Also representing the sophomore class is Allison Zom, escorted by Jake Stoltz. Allison is the daughter of Matt and Bobby Zom. She's involved in basketball, soccer, softball, cheerleading, BPA, Sunshine Society, show choir, Leos, and FFA. When Allison was a kid, she wanted to be a doctor, but now her future plans are to go to college and eventually raise a family. Escorting Allison is Jake Stoltz. Jake is the son of Bill and Lisa Stoltz. Jake is involved in basketball and soccer. When he was a kid, he wanted to be a doctor, but now his future plans are to attend college and become a physician. Allison Zom, Allison Zom and Jake Stoltz. First up, representing the junior class, we have Sydney Shepard, escorted by Devin Allen. Sydney is the daughter of Natalie Shepard and Jarvis and Stephanie Shepard. Sydney is involved in soccer, Sunshine Society, Pep Club, and NHS. When she was a kid, she wanted to be a vet, but now her future plans are to attend college and become a surgeon. Escorting Sydney is Devin Allen. Devin is the son of Michael and Leslie Allen. Devin is involved in soccer and NHS. When Devin was a kid, he wanted to be Thanos, but now his future plans are to defeat Iron Man. <laughs> Sydney Shepard and Devin Allen. I'd say those boys, you had that planned. I think so. <clears throat> also representing the junior class is Maddie Vanderweel and Cameron Markley. Maddie is the daughter of Todd and Kelly Vanderwill and Troy and Stacy Dunlap. Maddie is involved in student council, Sunshine Society, soccer, basketball, cheerleading, NHS, and FEA. When she was a kid, she wanted to be a teacher, but now her future plans are to attend college. Escorting Maddie Vanderwill is Cameron Markley. Cameron is the son of Brent and Lynette Markley. Cameron is involved in FFA, FCA, 4-H, NHS, lacrosse, and soccer. When Cameron was a kid, he wanted to be a bull rider, but now his future plans are to be a cowboy. <laughs> Maddie Vanderwill and Cameron Markley. <clears throat> First up representing the senior class is Madeline DeWolf and Caleb Ellis. <laughs> Madeline is the daughter of Michael and Terry DeWolf. She's involved in BPA, Sunshine Society, Leo's, Student Council, FEA, NHS, and Volleyball. When she was a kid, she wanted to be a nurse, but now her future plans are to follow her dreams and become a pediatric nurse, get married, have a couple kids, get a Subaru, become president of the PTA, and the best dang soccer mom in the state of Indiana. Escorting Madeline DeWolf is Caleb Ellis. Caleb is the son of Craig and Kristen Ellis. Caleb is involved in FCA, FFA, 
NHS, soccer, basketball, and baseball. When Caleb was a kid, he wanted to be a highwayman, but his future plans for now are to go home and go to bed. <laughs> Madeline DeWolf and Caleb Ellis. That boy's tired. <clears throat> also representing the senior class is Peyton Betts and Colin O'Dell. Peyton is the daughter of Sarah and Earl Betts. She's involved in Sunshine, Leo's, FCA, FFA, and soccer. When she was a kid, she wanted to be a vet, but now her future plans are to attend a four-year university and study nursing, or just to marry a rich man. <laughs> Escorting Peyton is Colin O'Dell. Colin is the son of Chris and Lori O'Dell. Colin is involved in FFA, 4-H, show choir, and basketball. When Colin was a kid, he wanted to be a NIPSCO worker, but now his future plans are to go to Purdue University and study data science, and after that, who knows? He's just a bag in the wind. Peyton Betts and Colin O'Dell. <clears throat> Lastly, representing the senior class is Macy Morris and Christian, or Chino Roke. Macy is the daughter of Ryan and Anna Morris. Macy is involved in Leo's, FFA, FCA, Student Council, Show Choir, 4-H, and Basketball. When she was a kid, she wanted to be a horse whisperer, but now her future plans are to study radiology through IU since she seems to be an expert at MRIs. Escorting Macy is Chino Roke. Chino is the son of Elmer and Bessie Roke. Chino is involved in show choir, Leos, and soccer. When Chino was a kid, he wanted to be a professional soccer player, but now he plans to attend college to major in exercise science as well as play college soccer. Macy Morris and Chino Roke. And now the part we've all been waiting for. Your 2019 homecoming prince is Cameron Markley. And presenting Cameron with the sash is last year's homecoming queen, Erin Edwards. Your 2019 homecoming princess is Madeline Vanderweel. All righty. Got to duck down a little bit for Aaron to be able to. <clears throat> Very nice. Of course, I'm a little partial. <laughs> well, we are. <laughs> Maddie's my niece, so you know. Your 2019 homecoming king is Caleb, Caleb Ellis. Caleb's having a pretty good year. He's having a great year. <laughs> Again, presenting Caleb with the crown and sash is last year's homecoming queen, Erin Edwards. <laughs> He's like, where do I stand? Where do I stand? <laughs> <laughs> and your 2019 homecoming queen is Macy Morris. <laughs> Macy's having a good year, too. Yes. You missed the part about she's um, <laughs> going to study radiology since she seems to be an expert at MRIs. <laughs> there you go. Of course, Macy tearing her ACL in a basketball game. Poor thing. Her sec yes. second ACL. So she's <laughs> what a trooper, though. What a trooper. A good there group is of your kids, yes. 2019 homecoming court. All right. One last round of applause. All right, fantastic, great. So what we're going to do is they're going to exit and they're going to start getting the boys yep. out and lining up they and go all that. They go do pictures and all that fun stuff. So we will take a break. We're going to come back. We'll come back. We'll watch the boys warm up, but we will not have any broadcast or anything. We'll take a few minutes. And before the game goes, we'll do the pregame. So, so what you're saying is we'll see picture, but we won't yes, have sound. We'll have so don't sound. think our sound is off. We've muted ourselves. We're going to yep. go get starting lineups and all that fun stuff. And then we'll be back for the pregame show. We'll be back after this. 
This is the 32nd time Christmas has been hosted in this house. After all, we've been farm our own since the 1920s. 32 times decorating the tree. Part of your community, we want to become your holiday dinner solutions provider. Co-Alliance offers the Memories. latest ag technology for your all operation. Protected by their scouting and fertilizers, nature. premium seed and precision and agriculture. We can help take your operation to the next level. Put the resources Auto that you're owners for insurance. Contact, Contact Jennings Alliance Insurance today. Agency today or visit one of our offices in Argus and Rochester. Argus Hardware is your local do-it-best hardware store, offering everything you need for your home improvement, lawn and garden, housewares, and home decor. Argus Hardware prides itself on a knowledgeable and friendly staff. Stop by today to stock up on all of your winter preparation needs, like shovels or ice melt. Argus Hardware is located at 200 West Walnut Street in Argus. Argus Hardware, your local do-it-best hardware store. Simplify your banking with a Simply Free checking account from First Federal Savings Bank. At First Federal Savings Bank, we appreciate your referrals. Refer your friends to open a Simply Free checking account. When your friend opens a checking account, you can both receive a free gift. It's easy as one, two... Got that new home edition and you're keeping it covered. Ooh, coverages now. I can help with this. Got zone coverage, man coverage, combo coverages. I don't know, Peyton. I think more like the coverage your nationwide agent offers. Oh. You want to go there. Home, auto, life, yeah. business, farm, boat, RV, ATV, camper, pet, motorcycle, your tour bus. Right. Did I mention farm? Contact Jennings Insurance Agency today or visit one of our offices in Argus and Rochester. Enjoy full screen television viewing of the new RTC TV4 family of networks anywhere you are with our new Roku channel. Simply purchase a Roku device from RTC or any Roku retailer, connect to your in-home Wi-Fi, then download the RTC TV4 channel. It's that easy. Watch all of our live channels 24-7 for free or subscribe to view all of our videos at your convenience. The RTC TV4 channel on Roku, another great service Whatever phone fits your style, RTC Fiber Communications can save you money when you switch to VoIP. VoIP is a phone service that leverages the power of the internet to save you money on your monthly phone bill. Same great service at a fraction of the cost. Contact RTC today to find out more about this money-saving offer. Online at www.rtc1.com. RTC Fiber Communications is proud to announce the new RTC TV4 family of networks. Now you can watch nine local video channels dedicated to covering the events that are important to you from anywhere in the world, 24 hours a day, seven days a week. And you can watch for free. Just download the mobile app, our new Roku channel, or online at www.rtctv4.com. The RTC TV4 family of networks. Start watching today. Hi, I'm John Oliver with a few reasons why your next pre-owned vehicle should be from Oliver Ford Lincoln. Imagine a 172-point certification along with a 44-point safety inspection. We even get you a vehicle history report. It's for your peace of mind because we treat our customers like family. You even get free car washes for life. So get more for your money and more for your trade with certified pre-owned at Oliver Ford Lincoln in Plymouth. At First Federal Savings Bank, we offer a wide variety of services for our customers. We offer a variety of deposit products, such as personal and business accounts. We pride ourselves in being one of the top mortgage lenders in Indiana. We offer commercial lending and business checking to help with your business banking needs. Through LPL Financial, our financial services department is here to help you with your financial planning needs. Come see us today and see how our family can help your family. Think of this as a high school weight room. It's more like a high school classroom. I'm learning how to manage my time here. I'm learning that it's important to have goals and that it takes persistence and commitment to reach them. And I'm learning that the best way to lead is by example. Indiana High School Sports. 
They're more than just a game. Come and see me play. <laughs> Save money when you switch your home phone service to VoIP from RTC. Everyone knows that RTC Fiber Communication is the area's leading provider of high-speed fiber optic internet service. Now, RTC can help save you money on your monthly phone bill by switching your phone over to the internet with VoIP. Same great service at a fraction of the cost. Contact RTC today to find out more about this money-saving offer. Online at www.rtc1.com. Oliver Ford is the largest certified pre-owned dealer in Michiana. Our inventory changes daily and you are guaranteed the best customer service in our area. We treat you like family. Every certified pre-owned Ford includes factory-backed warranty coverage, complimentary vehicle history report and lots more. Don't miss out on our end-of-year discounts on all of our good-as-new inventory. Rates low as we have ever seen and the best customer service you have ever experienced. RTC Cable subscribers, now you can watch your favorite cable networks wherever you are, on your phone, tablet, or computer. Just log on to www.watchtveverywhere.com. Enter your RTC account information and sign up to watch TV everywhere. Live sports, videos on demand, and more, all for free with your RTC Cable subscription. Watch TV everywhere, another great service from RTC. Neighbors help each other. It's how our community works. And it's how we do business at RTC. We know you count on us for fiber internet, TV, and phone service. Backed by friendly local support. Your hard-earned dollars stay right here as we invest in our community, our people, and smart technology. RTC Fiber Communications. We're your hometown communications provider, working hard to be a good neighbor. At Co-Alliance Propane, we treat our customers like neighbors because, well, that's what we are. When you trust Co-Alliance Propane as your seriously local propane provider, you're trusting a team of professionals who live, work, and watch the game from right across the county, not the country. A team that's close by and seriously dedicated to your safety and providing the best service possible. Find out more about Co-Alliance Propane's seriously local service and how you can get 50 gallons of propane free at CoAlliancePropane.com. Simplify your banking with a Simply Free Checking account from First Federal Savings Bank. All it takes is $50 to open the account with no minimum balance and no monthly service fees. For a limited time, you will also receive a free gift just for opening the account. And with Instant Issue, we can give you a debit card right when you open your account, giving you immediate access to your funds. Simply Free Checking from First Federal Savings Bank, a simpler way to bank. And remember, we don't want to be the biggest bank, just the best bank. All right, and we're back. Beautiful fieldway by Gymnasium and Argus. The teams are running in. In case you missed it, homecoming court for the uh, Prince and Princess. We had Cameron Markley as the Prince and Madeline Vanderwill as the Princess. And for the homecoming court, the King for this year was Kayla Bellis and the queen was Macy Morris. So that was real nice. Congratulations to everyone. Everyone looked outstanding. All represent Argus very well. Very proud of them. So the Dragons come out two and two on the season with a double overtime victory over the LaVille Lancers, which is kind of a coincidence because last year they took the win over Jimtown Jimmies with a double overtime <laughs> victory for them. John Harrell had it a two-point game, and now he's changed his tune, and he has Jimtown winning by about 17. So uh, we'll see what happens. He's been off all season with when it's come to both the Dragon teams, so we'll see where it's at. 
Uh, for the first couple of the Lady Dragons, he had us losing, and we won both of those. So uh, we'll see uh, how this one turns out. The boys are excited and ready to go. They've had a pretty good uh, run of games and battling, so I think uh, that double overtime win is uh, going to give them a little bit of fuel. Some great play from Manikowski, Riddle, Nifung. So it's really helped the Dragons. Everyone's putting in their time as role players. But uh, I tell you what, uh, even Ellis, the seniors have really stepped it up and have been working. So The band's playing the fight song. Got just a couple minutes left before the national anthem. And we'll do the starting lineups. I don't have it for the uh, Gymtown Jimmies yet. They didn't have it when I went down there, so we're just gonna go by the on the fly. Are you flying by the seat of your pants? You betcha. Oh my gosh! Hey, are we saying hi to Aunt Nancy tonight? I think Aunt Nancy's down there. She might be watching again down in uh, Carolinas. Hi, Aunt Nancy. Give and her I know, a shout out. I yep. know Lexi is here, so we won't be giving Lexi a shout out. <laughs> well, most of our college viewers yep. are back for Christmas break. Any of you college kids that are still at college, getting your finals in, uh, I know there are still some colleges that go through next week. Good luck to you. Yep. Shout out to our nephew, Vinny, U of Indy, soccer, final four appearance out in Pennsylvania. Fantastic job for them, farther than any team has ever made it in their school's history. And when you get to the Final Four in D2 soccer, you are representing well. That is big time stuff for him. So we've got about 45 seconds left till our national anthem and starting lineup. So I want to give a big shout out to everybody watching. Hoping everyone's having a safe holiday so far and we want to make sure we continue that. Get these kids through one more week yep. of school. They're excited, they're ready for Christmas break. You betcha. So. Uh, Give a shout out to the Argus Lions Club. They uh, sponsored Santa at the Argus Public Library today. And we want to thank you, say thank you to yes. all of them. It and was a, fantastic. A thank you to Santa for taking time out of his busy schedule and coming and well, visiting he, with the kids. He, and he put his shop on hold and had his elves hold down the fort. And, well, uh, they take care of all of it anyway. Fantastic. So we're getting ready for the national anthem. And then uh, we'll have the starting lineups after that. Darius Pep Band led by music teacher Austin Mills. The band sounding better and better every game. All right, number three, Bill Pollock. Number 22, Clay Campbell. Number 24, Preston Phillips. Number 32, Braden Rice. And number 50, Blake Glasserson. All right. 
number three, senior, Sam Manikowski. Number 23, sophomore, Mikey Richard. And number 25, senior, Jeremiah Little. Number 33, senior, Caleb Ellis. And the senior, number 35, Owen Nightfall. All righty. Big game here tonight. We got head coach for Jimtown Jimmy's. All right, it is. Well, they don't have it listed here, so I don't have it. What Sorry about for? that. What are you looking for? Head town, head coach. For who? Six, seven. Sorry. For the who? The Jimmy's? Yep. Matt Schaus. Oh. You're looking at the one. They got them all right down there. So. Oh, they got them on oh, the JV yeah. roster. I'm looking at Varsity. Sash wins it over Riddle. Point guard, 6-7 with uh, Phillips. Knife arms on him. They look. Riddle reaches in, settles him down. Rotates it around. It's going to be a long night for the Dragons on defense. Let's see what they can do. Dribbles in, looks. Kicks it out. Euro step counts, I guess. <laughs> I have to look that one up. Yeah, I don't know. Defense picks up his dribble. Manikowski picks it up. He's going to trap with the big man up top on defense. Ellis feeds it to Knife on. Knife on for two and puts it in. Owen's been having a great game. He's been playing really well lately. Yep. They all have. Rotates it over. Looks. Gets it down. Kicks it out. Loose. Campbell. Kicks in the corner. Garrison had it. Phillips drives, looks, kicks it over. Palak. Campbell. Rice. Stolen by Nifong. He's going up. Got himself a little bit underneath the basket. And it's kind of a block, but I think it was going to hit the bottom of the rim. Sorry, and I was so interested in watching that. I, yeah. Shots up, and it's in and out. Rebound goes to Manikowski. Knifeong kicks out, gets the ball. Riddle, Richards. Manikowski, quick three. Off. Riddle just about had to rebound. Phillips comes away with it. Kicks it over, tipped out by Manikowski, stays. Jim Towns ball, they're gonna inbound it. Gets it, Riddle just about stole it again. Quick hands from Riddle. He was a rebounding machine the other night. Had 13. <laughs> Screened. Shots up and misses. Richard has it. Goes through two. Puts it over to Manikowski. Jumper. Bucket, Manikowski. On the two from the field. Ellis all over him. Kicks it around. Campbell has it. Phillips. Going to call the foul on Ellis. On the ground. Ellis is first. Games first. Obviously, teams first. Don't be jinxing it. Goes long. Campbell catches. Picks up one dribble. Kicks it out. Open three, and it's 
good. One of two from three-point range from Pollock. Gets the riddle. Manikowski, open jumper, and no good. Push from behind, Campbell, he's back. Totally put his back into him. Yep. Sideways. Richard was in the air and had room for it. First foul for the Jimmies. Richard fakes. Gets it to Riddle. Manikowski. Fakes. Looks. Ellis. Nifong. Jumper. Off. Rebound. Ellis. Oh, and it's stolen. Phillips good. fouled on the ground. Mikey Richards with the foul. Mikey Richie working hard as a sophomore, earning his place out on the court. Campbell has it. Going to get it into Phillips. Pollock throws it up, and it's good. Two for three from him. Dragons will happily watch him. Splits him. Knife on. On his stripped. Kicks it back. Fakes. Campbell. Drives. Oh. Fouled and won. Strong football player, you can tell it. Well, drop the shoulder there. Yeah, he's, he uses his strength. Ellis, Riddle. Got Colin O'Dell and Ted Redinger coming into the game for the Dragons. Giving Ellis and Riddle a break. Dragons down, 10 to four. Campbell at the line. And he puts it in. Richards. Manikowski bails it out. Foul. It's going to be his second foul. <laughs> he comes over to the bench and tells the coach that's two. Richards coming out, and then comes Stoltz. Well, you can't push him out a little. Balance. Yeah, it's it. <clears throat> physical player. Yeah. I like him. I like him, but you got to watch it. The officials, if they're calling it tight, you got to behave. Stoltz has it. Odell, Manikowski, shot with pressure, oh, I misses. That was be bankered. Pollock. Boom. Three in a row. And Jimtown taking that big lead by 10 with 2.47 left in the first, 14 to 4. We'll be back after this. The Winning Edge is your local provider for all your school athletic needs. From providing customizable sportswear to engraving trophies, the Winning Edge strives to help teams find their edge on the playing field. Visit the Winning Edge today. Locally owned and operated, Mike's Trash LLC in Rochester is your local service for all your trash removal needs. Whether you're a big business or a local resident, Mike's Trash LLC will be sure to take care of all your waste removal needs. Contact Mike's Trash LLC today. All right, we're back. Coach Mossman with a quick timeout. Dragons down 14 to four. And Pollock putting a show on from the three point line going three of four so far in the first quarter. Stoltz. Redinger. Odell. Manikowski. Redinger gets it, looks, kicks it over to Stoltz. Knife on. 
Odell for three, and it's short. Splits him. Kicks it over in the corner. Pollock for three, and he's off the mark. Tipped out to Phillips. Shot, and lays it in. Sixteen to four. Dragons are in a little bit of trouble here. Reininger. Stoltz kicks it over to Nifong. Battles. Shot. Blocked. Rotates it. Manikowski's on Pollock now. Garrison over to Phillips. Looks low. Rotates. Thirty-four. Conrath came in. Twenty-four made that one. Yep. Phillips again with the bucket. Two straight buckets. Stoltz. Odell. Nifong. 45 seconds left in the first. Manikowski draws the fake and doesn't get it. He's shooting two at the line. We got the mullet and the 70s headband. <laughs> I see mullets are coming back. Are you going to grow yeah. one? No. No? I don't think so. Put those in the trash. Hold on a sec, I'm gonna go take care of something. All right, sorry about that. 37 seconds left in the first. Dragons trailing 18 to six. Manikowski out high. <laughs> Got 12. Phillips kicks it out. Quick, uh -huh. not even close. And that's going to do it. Dragons go in trailing 18 to 6 after the first. We'll be back after these messages. Let RTC TV4 highlight your business or service in our local sports coverage. Through our platform, you, you have the option to use a 30-second commercial like that you already and have, or you can have experience. us make a 15-second logo sponsorship for you. Happy for years. From simple maintenance to major repairs, With eight local we schools in our partnership, we're sure you'll beat your intended audience. So we have an excellent source of demonstrator vehicles offered to you with Sponsor with RTC TV4 so today. Sponsor with online or stop in for a test drive at Oliver Ford Lincoln in Plymouth. This is the 32nd time Christmas has been hosted in this house. 32 times decorating the tree, holiday dinners, memories, all protected by their independent agent and the company that stands behind them. Auto Owners Insurance. Contact Jennings Insurance Agency today or visit one of our offices in Argus and Rochester. And we're back. Hey, while we're waiting, January 17th, they're going to honor the state soccer team at the Argus Boys Oregon Davis game. They present their rings, maybe. And present the rings. Banner. I think maybe? the banner might be put up by then. I don't know. We'll have to see what else is going on. Not sure what time that game starts. We're still trying to figure that out. When we do, we'll let you know. Yeah, Oregon Come Davis join us. may not have a JV team, so that's why it's messing up trying to figure out the starting time. Ellis 
Whipped away by Phillips. Kicks it out. And that's his third. He was set. Yep. He was there, but he also started, <laughs> started falling a little bit early, but he's there. Running her out. Mikey Richard in. So everyone's in started except for Riddle, who's been replaced by Odell at the moment. Nifong has it. Manikowski. It's off his foot. You betcha. Richard for three. Off. Tipped. Rebound. Knife on. Spins. And battles it in. Gets it. Puts it over. Rice. Bucket. And Leaned one. Into him that time. Yep. And then comes Riddle. And out will go most likely Ellis with his... Second. Second on the evening. Oh, Odell. And Riddle's back in. And doesn't get the roll and knife on with the rebound. Ellis, knife on. Riddle. Riddle's got a slight height advantage on his player. You ought to try to take advantage of that. Manikowski. Quick hands from Phillips. Tips it away. Manikowski with the foul. Little body bump. Yep. Ellis is out, and the freshman Morris comes in. All right. Cross the timeline. Rice kicks to the Phillips. Out. Caddy corner. Long three, and it's long. Rebound by Redinger. Timeout. Jimtown. We got hit pretty hard there. We're going to take a quick break. We'll be back after this. This is the 32nd time Christmas has been hosted in this house. 32 times decorating the tree. You're treated like family. Holiday dinners. Full service experience. Our experts can keep your vehicle all protected by their independent agent. And the company that stands behind them. Auto Owners Insurance. Contact Jennings Insurance Agency today or visit one of our offices in Argus and Rochester. And we're back. 5.43 left in the second. Dragons trailing 20 to 8. Phillips kicks it over. Down low. Pollock, quick three. I don't think he was ready for it, and he wasn't. And rebound goes to Morris. Mikey Richard has it. Kicks it over. Riddle saves the pass. Shot. 
Missed. Tipped. And rebound. Goes to Jimtown. Phillips. Long, quick three, and it's off the mark. Now they are dying by the three, missing about the last five in a row. Dragons need to convert a point or two off of these trips down the court. Riddle has it. Redinger. Morris. Mikey Richard. Knife on drives. Puts it up and nothing. Just misses. Had three guys on him. Phillips gets up. Gets the ball. Down low. Puts it in. Big man Garrettson puts it in for two. Riddle. Ah, uh, travel. Manikowski's coming in. Wagner's coming out. Coach Mostyn looking for that combination. Get the Dragons back in it. Man-to-man -man defense. What a feed. What a feed and a good bucket. Dragons getting taken two here in the first half. Morris. Riddle. Phillips with the block. I'm not sure he knew he was behind him. Yep. Block. Banikowski. Keeping Pollock honest behind the three-point line. Crossover. Pollock puts it in for two. We'll take a full timeout. All right, full timeout. Dragons trailing 26 to 8. We'll be back after this. At Co Alliance, we understand the importance of community. After all, we've been farmer owned since the 1920s. When you shop and now that we're a part of your community, we you're want to become like your family. total agronomy and solutions provider. Co Alliance offers the latest in ag technology for your operation. For From field scouting and fertilizers, to fertilizers, premium seed and precision agriculture, we can help take your operation to the next level. Put the resources of your local cooperative contact Co Alliance today. So search our inventory online or stop in for a test drive at Oliver Ford Lincoln in Plymouth. Argus Hardware is your local do-it-best hardware store, offering everything you need for your home improvement, lawn and garden, housewares, and home decor. Argus Hardware prides itself on a knowledgeable and friendly staff. Stop by today to stock up on all of your winter preparation needs, like shovels or ice melt. Argus Hardware is located at 200 West Walnut Street in Argus. Argus Hardware, your local do-it-best hardware store. And we're back. 2.42 left in the second. Dragons trailing 26 to 8. Having some issues getting the offense rolling and wasn't quite ready for Pollock with his three-point prowess being three of five on the evening from the three-point line. And he just put in a single bucket there. Manikowski with a throwaway. Shot. Good. Yeah. 
Dragons down by 21. Knife long to Manikowski. Blocked again. Phillips. Kicks it out. Stolen. Manikowski. Yep. Reached in on him as Manikowski was going around him. And Manikowski on the bench. Ellis back in. Richard. iPhone. Long three. And he misses. Phillips with another rebound. Long three, and it's off the mark. Rebound put in. And no one is missing, especially at that distance at the moment, <clears throat> for Jimtown. 31 to eight. Pat Bach trying to get him back in a little bit. <clears throat> Ellis fakes. Goes, foul. Downward swing with the arm. That should be on number two. Barham's, Barham's. Barham's. Don't have a number five listed. Oh wait, Ethan Allen. It's 44 or five. <coughs> Excuse me. Drives, throws it up, and gets it to fall. And that's his kind of night tonight. <laughs> when you're on, you're on. He probably has 15 already, close to it. When are we back here? Next Saturday? What's the schedule for televisation next week? Is it just Saturday? Saturday, two games. Saturday, two games. through three or four, no foul. Lays it in. I think we have a whole Saturday plan, don't we? Yeah. Richard has it and loses it. Should be our yep. ball. Nobody touched no it. No way. No, nobody touched it. He totally lost oh, his I dribble. Thought it went. No, I thought I saw it. Okay. Unfortunately. Shots up. And it's off. So that's the end of the first half. Dragons trailing 35 to 8. We'll be back with the unofficial stats after these messages. Simplify your banking with a Simply Free Checking account from First Federal Savings Bank. At First Federal Savings Bank, we appreciate your referrals. Refer your friends to open a Simply Free Checking account. When your friend opens a checking account, you can both receive a free gift. It's easy as one, two, three. Simply Free Checking from First Federal Savings Bank, a simpler way to bank. And remember, we don't want to be the biggest bank, just the best bank. At Oliver Ford Lincoln in Plymouth. Got that new home edition and you're keeping it covered. Ooh, coverages now. I can help with this. Got zone coverage, man coverage, combo coverages. I don't know, Peyton. I think more like the coverage your nationwide agent offers. Oh, you want to go there? Home, auto, life, yeah. business, farm, boat, right. RV, ATV, camper, pet, motorcycle, your tour bus. Right. Did I mention farm? Contact Jennings Insurance Agency today or visit one of our offices in Argus and Rochester. Want to know what I like best about playing basketball for my high school? I like it because it's a place where my friends get to see me play. I like it because I'm playing for someone besides myself. 
I'm playing for everybody in my school and every person in my community. Indiana High School Sports. They're more than just a game. Come and see me play. shop at Oliver Ford Lincoln in Plymouth, you're treated like family and it's a full service experience. Our expert service team can keep your vehicle happy for years from simple maintenance to major repairs. We even provide a loaner car if your vehicle needs to stay overnight. So we have an excellent source of demonstrator vehicles offered to you with substantial discounts. At Co-Alliance Propane, we treat our customers like neighbors because, well, that's what we are. When you trust Co-Alliance Propane as your seriously local propane provider, you're trusting a team of professionals who live, work, and watch the game from right across the county, not the country. A team that's close by and seriously dedicated to your safety and providing the best service possible. Find out more about Co-Alliance Propane's seriously local service and how you can get 50 gallons of propane free at CoAlliancePropane.com. Neighbors help each other. It's how our community works. And it's how we do business at RTC. We know you count on us for fiber internet, TV, and phone service backed by friendly local support. Your hard-earned dollars stay right here as we invest in our community, our people, and smart technology. RTC Fiber Communications. We're your hometown communications provider working hard to be a good neighbor. At First Federal Savings Bank, we offer a wide variety of services for our customers. We offer a variety of deposit products, such as personal and business accounts. We pride ourselves in being one of the top mortgage lenders in Indiana. We offer commercial lending and business checking to help with your business banking needs. Through LPL Financial, our financial services department is here to help you with your financial planning needs. Come see us today and see how our family can help your family. Got that new home edition and you're keeping it covered. Ooh, coverages now. I can help with this. Got zone coverage, man coverage, combo coverages. I don't know, Peyton. I think more like the coverage your nationwide agent offers. Oh, you want to go there. Home, auto, life, yep. business, farm, right. boat, RV, ATV, camper, pet, motorcycle, your tour bus. Right. Did I mention farm? Contact Jennings Insurance Agency today or visit one of our offices in Argus and Rochester. RTC Fiber Communications is proud to announce the new RTC TV4 family of networks. Now you can watch nine local video channels dedicated to covering the events that are important to you from anywhere in the world, 24 hours a day, seven days a week. And you can watch for free. Just download the mobile app, our new Roku channel, or online at www.rtctv4.com. The RTC TV4 family of networks. Start watching today. Simplify your banking with a Simply Free checking account from First Federal Savings Bank. All it takes is $50 to open the account with no minimum balance and no monthly service fees. For a limited time, you will also receive a free gift just for opening the account. And with Instant Issue, we can give you a debit card right when you open your account, giving you immediate access to your funds. Simply Free checking from First Federal Savings Bank, a simpler way to bank. And remember, we don't want to be the biggest bank, just the best bank. Oliver Ford is the largest certified pre-owned dealer in Michiana. Our inventory changes daily and you are guaranteed the best customer service in our area. We treat you like family. Every certified pre-owned Ford includes factory-backed warranty coverage, complimentary vehicle history report and lots more. Don't miss out on our end-of-year discounts on all of our good-as-new inventory. Rates low as we have ever seen and the best customer service you have ever experienced. Save money when you switch your home phone service to VoIP from RTC. Everyone knows that RTC Fiber Communication is the area's leading provider of high-speed fiber optic internet service. Now, RTC can help save you money on your monthly phone bill by switching your phone over to the internet with VoIP. Same great service at a fraction of the cost. Contact RTC today to find out more about this money-saving offer online at www.rtc1.com. 
RTC cable subscribers. Now you can watch your favorite cable networks wherever you are, on your phone, tablet, or computer. Just log on to www.watchtveverywhere.com. Enter your RTC account information and sign up to watch TV everywhere. Live sports, videos on demand, and more, all for free with your RTC cable subscription. Watch TV everywhere, another great service from RTC. This is the 32nd time Christmas has been hosted in this house. 32 times decorating the tree, holiday dinners, memories, all protected by their independent agent and the company that stands behind them. Auto Owners Insurance. Contact Jennings Insurance Agency today or visit one of our offices in Argus and Rochester. Got much choice. All right, we're back. They're doing some stuff down at the book, so we're unable to get the halftime unofficial stats, anyways. But the Dragons are trailing by 27 at the moment. So I know that uh, looks like Pollock has 14, 15, possibly already on the evening. And he's done very well for him. So Dragons are a little bit off tonight so far. And it looks like John Harrell might actually be on point for his prediction for once this season. Somehow they got to figure out how to get through the tower. Well, we're going to see if they can... Uh, improve and cut into this lead. To think that they're going to come back and win this is be very, very difficult. But we want them to make a game of it. So that's what we're looking for. Coach Mawson's got them in a circle down there. So we'll see what happens. Minute left in the halftime. So. Give a shout out to everyone. If they send us a message, we'll send you a shout out. Or just come say hi to us if you're at the game. Oh, wait, then they couldn't hear us. Uh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> well, they could be watching on their phone. But Hey, Kyle Odell's grandpa said that by next week they'll be gone. Yep. So yeah. we'll, give, we'll give them a shout out, Grandpa Odell. Yep. So what is our schedule next week? We will be here next Saturday. Saturday. That's what I, th I think I know. So next Thursday, the girls play away at Peru. Yep. Obviously, we're not covering that. Um, Friday, the boys are home with South Bend Career Academy. Um, but we're not covering that one. We will be here Saturday. Uh, girls Varsity JV contest starts at 2 p.m. against Manchester. And then the varsity is playing West Central oh, about 3.30. We'll be covering that varsity game. Yep. That night, the boys are playing Pioneer here at home. Pioneer is another one of our RTC networks. Family, family of sports. Yeah, we'll be covering that. Uh, JV tip starts at 6, and we'll cover that varsity contest. And then Christmas break starts, so... And there you go. We've got a couple games in that time period. So we got Super Saturday next Saturday. Super Saturday, I like it. Rebound. We're going to bring fruit because we've had enough cookies. Puts it in for two. <laughs> Puts it in with a hand in his face. 
Manikowski. Richard. Travel. Knife on. Jumper. No good. Rebound. Campbell. A little bit of foul trouble early on. Got the big rebound there. Rice. Phillips. And one. Not the way he, Coach Mawson wanted the second half to start. Dragons down by 31. Biggest gap in score I've seen in I don't know how long. 32. Manikowski has it. Pioneer's a slightly larger school than Argus. About three, over three times the size. Jimtown? Or Jimtown, yeah, sorry. Yep. Last year, Argus beat him. Stolen by Phillips. <clears throat> Leads it up. Kicks it back. Jump, jump. <laughs> Rebound. Shot missed. Tipped. Ellis turns and goes. Knife on. Mikey Richard for three. And he puts it in. It's a big uh, shot from Richard. Second three attempt. He's shooting 500. He had a critical three the other night against oh, Laville. Tied it up. Tied it up. Took it into the second overtime. Kicks it out. Pollock has it. Foul. Knife on. Knife on's first of the evening. Off of Argus stays Jimtown. I call that. Yep. It's only his first on the evening. Nifong puts it in for two. Dragons battling back a little bit. Campbell out high. Foul. Oh, what was it? Oh, and he called him Campbell no, I, on the charge. Pushed back and they wow, used their bodies quite a bit. Yeah, he'll be coming out. Manikowski, fakes, shot, missed. Rebound, Phillips, not wasting time, leads it out to Pollock. Puts it in for two. Manikowski. Mikey Richards short. Rebound goes to Jimtown. 
three. In and out. Good rebound and knocked out of bounds. Going to be Dragons basketball. All right. And here comes Richard. Manikowski. Riddle. Knife on. Defense rotating it on them. Ellis kicks it down to knife on. Jumper. Short. Rebound goes Jimtown. Layup and good. Morris is going back in for the Dragons. Nifong has it. Ellis. Nifong. Kicks it over. Great save. Down the riddle. Size. Shooting two. Riddle, in. Just missed. Phillips with the rebound. Here he comes. Smart pass out. Oh, misread. We touched it, I take it? Ha! Huh. No. He, I didn't see us touch it. I thought he just threw it out of bounds. Well, oh. well, no one's complaining, so. Campbell back in, playing with four fouls. <clears throat> Kicks it down, breaker. Fakes. Campbell doesn't look like he'd be the typical three-point shooter. No call. Rebound, Morris. Tipped out. Nifong has it. Caddy corner. Morris. Three. In and out. Rebound, Riddle. Shots up and one. Great little left hand. Jump over there. Jump hook. 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 Ken Dig, Ian there in the house, chilling. Ian, Ken Dig in the house. We'll get him to suit Hi, up. Yeah, Nancy. <laughs> we can have him suit up real quick. Yeah, I think they'd know. Throw a uniform on him. They'll remember his dunk from last year. Riddle makes that one. He's at Holy <laughs> Cross in South Bend playing ball. <laughs> All right. 17. Dragons have already got more points in this quarter than what they had in the entire first half. I love you and your math is amazing today. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> Foul. Campbell going to the line. You know me, I like my math. What? What? No, I like the math. Oh, Those okay. are the things I look at. I love numbers. You're looking at me yeah. like... You're crazy. I might be crazy. Maybe, maybe. Campbell puts it in. <laughs> Put
McLean with four fouls. Missed. Push from behind. Um, 34. Yep. Manikowski drives and one again. <clears throat> well, shouldn't have been doing that all game, I guess. But they tried a couple times and we're getting hit. Some of the taller guys, Phillips is out. So it's a little easier when the six seven gentleman is on the bench. Manikowski puts it in. Forty seconds left in the third. Dragons trailing. Forty-five to twenty. Caddy corner. Missed. Rebound. Manikowski. Riddle recovers it. Great work from Manikowski and Riddle. Seventeen seconds. Gets him in the air, shot, missed, rebound, Morris, blocked. Shots long distance and no good, and that's gonna do it for the end of the third. Dragons going trailing 45 to 20. We'll be back after this. Let RTC TV4 highlight your business or service in our local sports coverage. Through our platform, you have the option to use a 30 second commercial that you already have, or you can have us make a 15 second logo sponsorship for you. With eight local schools in our partnership, we're sure you'll reach your intended audience. Sponsor with RTC TV4 today. Oliva Ford is the largest certified pre owned dealer in Michigan. Our inventory changes daily and you are guaranteed the best customer service in our area. We treat you like family. Every certified pre-owned Ford includes factory-backed warranty coverage, complimentary vehicle history report and lots more. Don't miss out on our end-of-year discounts on all of our good-as-new inventory. Rates low as we have ever seen and the best customer service you have ever experienced. And we're back. Of course, they get the Neil Diamond going, and of course, somebody decides to sing. Phil, don't quit Andy, your day job. Andy, I thought job. you were going to do a solo. <laughs> nope. Phil cannot quit his day <laughs> job. Let's just say that. Oh, sweet Caroline. <clears throat> I'm do the bomb, bomb, bomb. <clears throat> yes, yes, he tried it, and uh, he went right back to Pepsi. <laughs> All right. Morris has it out high. Knife on. Back door. Lost. Thrown out. No good. Dragons turnover. Hi, boy. Put it in. And Phillips with the alley -oop. Dragons down by 27 again. Foul, Phillips, and he knows it. It's gonna put the Dragons at the line. Riddle. Puts it in. I got another one for Riddle. Defense! 
Stolen by Riddle. Gets it over to Manikowski. Back to Riddle. Jeremiah still battling hard. Nifong, three. In and out, rebound. Rice, here he comes. Kicks it over. Campbell, Rice, down low, foul. Shooting two. That's his third. <laughs> Fills in the candy. <laughs> and that's Ellis's third of the evening. Into the fourth quarter, and Ellis has the most fouls on the Dragons team with three. Shots up, and good. If you've got a business and you want to advertise with us here, contact RTC. Let Andy and I know. We'll find the information. We'll get it to you. Phil Dean, Steve Stricker, somebody. We can help you. We'll play your advertisements at halftimes, timeouts. Nifong drives baseline and throws it away. Phillips. Shot, foul, block. Manikowski. Should be his second. With the hack, it is his second, according to my stats. And I actually have that one correct. I'm telling you, you're doing my job tonight. I guess. Ooh. Kind of surprised on that miss. I can't run camera in. Stats? I can try. Well. Yeah. I'm female. I can multitask. Uh-huh. <laughs> Shots up and good. iPhone comes around him. Redinger. Timeout, Coach Mawson. Six minutes, one second left in the fourth. 22 to 50, the Dragons Trail. We'll be back after these messages. RTC Cable subscribers. Now you can watch your favorite cable networks wherever you are, on your phone, tablet, or computer. Just log on to www.watchtveverywhere.com. Enter your RTC account information and sign up to watch TV everywhere. Live sports, videos on demand, and more, all for free with your RTC Cable subscription. Watch TV everywhere, another great service from RTC. Dragons back. Six left in the game. Manikowski. Redinger. Double team. Back to Manikowski. Baseline jumper and just misses. Phillips. Switch hands and puts it in. Redinger. Morris. Manikowski. Riddle. Up and good. Switch hand over to Campbell. <clears throat> Redinger. Morris has it. Riddle. Redinger drives, pulls back, gives it to Manikowski. 
Nifong fakes over Campbell and it's off. Ball's loose, tipped out, and it's going to stay Dragon's ball. Knife on to bring the ball in. Gets it over to Riddle. Manikowski, fade away, misses, over the back. Riddle draws the foul again. Riddle's done a fantastic job. Right in and out, Richard in. Riddle makes no. He says, "Come on back, I got another." <laughs> well, sometimes you get excited. You do. Misses. I think Riddle's five of seven from the line tonight. Was that a rough uh, screen there? Or? Knife long wasn't ready for it. And one. <laughs> JJ says, get off me. Yep. Now Phillips went into him after the shot. Yeah. It was. He had his hands up, but he still ran into him, so. Puts it in. Manikowski gets it. Knife on. Riddle. Manikowski. Morris recovers. Manikowski's pass was on the back side of Riddle's hands. <coughs> Jumper, Manikowski. Timeout for Coach Mawson, 30, 30 seconds. Second. We'll be back after these messages. Neighbors help each other. It's how our community works. And it's how we do business at RTC. We know you count on us for fiber internet, TV, and phone service backed by friendly local support. Your hard-earned dollars stay right here as we invest in our community, our people, and smart technology. RTC Fiber Communications. We're your hometown communications provider working hard to be a good neighbor. All right, we're back. 322 left in the game. Dragons trailing by 30. Jim Towns ball. Inbound it. Dragons into the court. Puts it over. Rotates. Teddy corner. Pollock for three, and it's in again. Been pretty quiet the second half. 60-27. Riddle looks, drives, he's got the lane. Fouled. Shooting two. On a lackluster game for the Dragons for the most, uh, Riddle has shined. Going to the basket, really putting himself out there, getting himself to the line. Making it on. Yeah. 
Boom. And for a riddle. Rotates it. Fakes. Looks. Kicks it out. Phillips rotates. Got Manikowski on Phillips. Oh, and knife on out. Shots up. No good. Rebound. Riddle again. Here comes Manikowski. Jumper. Misses. Tipped. Riddle. Pulls it down. Shot. And puts it in for two more. <laughs> And timeout to get some subs in for Jimtown. Should be a 30 second. Let's see. Oh, it's full timeout. Time out. We'll be back after this. At Co-Alliance Propane, we treat our customers like neighbors because, well, that's what we are. When you trust Co-Alliance Propane as your seriously local propane provider, you're trusting a team of professionals who live, work, and watch the game from right across the county, not the country. A team that's close by and seriously dedicated to your safety and providing the best service possible. Find out more about Co-Alliance Propane's seriously local service and how you can get 50 gallons of propane free at coalliancepropane.com. Simplify your banking with a Simply Free checking account from First Federal Savings Bank. All it takes is $50 to open the account with no minimum balance and no monthly service fees. For a limited time, you will also receive a free gift just for opening. And we're back. Two minutes, seven seconds left. Dragons down by 30. A rarity to ever say that. Been a tough game. Campbell rotates in. Phillips is out. We got 6-4. Pollock's out. Sophomore. Dylan Kindig in. Yep. Kindig making an appearance. Rice has the ball. Down low. Shots up and misses. Jump ball. And going to remain Jim Towns. Nope. Dragon's bat. Nope, Jim Towns ball. I was going to say. Oh, no, he's got the arrow pointing. He pointed We it. have no clue what we're doing. <laughs> Neither team at the we're moment. They're all tired. There. Puts it in. Rotates it. Gets it to him. Rice. Campbell rotates it out. Moving screen. <laughs> Minute left in the game. Dragons down by 30. Rice has it for Jimtown. Jimtown is content to just dribble around. Oh, they definitely don't need any more points. Tipped away. Recovered. Campbell has it. 30 seconds. Shots up. Oh, and he calls a charge. <laughs> Missed the shot anyways. Said or not, you can't. Odell went down. Drew the charge. Morris has it. Odell has it. Ellis. Kendig. Morris for three. Misses. Ellis with the big rebound. T steps on the line and he's out of bounds. Ten seconds left on the dot. Dragons down by 30. And it looks like it's going to end that way as clock runs out. And that's going to do it. Dragons fall. 61 31. <laughs> 
Phil's waving me off, saying that <laughs> we started late. We had long coverage with the we started early. homecoming. Yeah. Started early, and he's ready to get going. So we're going to cut it out short for the Dragons. Unofficial. That's about all I have. I have <clears throat> Nipong with six. Richards with three. Manikowski with seven or eight. And it looks like Riddle at six. Thirteen, to the best of our knowledge. But we're, uh, we're not too concerned at the moment. It's not a big, uh, been a big, good game. But next Saturday, we'll have everything around for the doubleheader action between the girls and then the boys later on in the evening. So about about 3.30, depending on whenever that JV girls game gets done, we'll Get carry number. the girls varsity with West Central. And then we'll be back here around 7.15-ish for the boys' Pioneer game. So... All right. With that being said, for Phil Dean and Amy on the camera and helping with the mic, and for Andy Stone, everyone be safe and God bless. <laughs>